Hey, it's been a while since I've done a video, so let's do something fun. You ever heard of cryo freezing? Or maybe cool sculpting? Have you ever heard of biohacking? Okay. So this is something I've been interested in for a while. Biohacking is essentially anything that you do on your own without medical uh, instruction or provider giving you advice. And uh, it modifies your own body in some fashion. Of course, the main point in biohacking is to fix some element of your body. Maybe it's a health problem, or maybe it's simply to improve an aspect of your body or of your uh, senses. Cool sculpting can be found in the same vein. The idea takes advantage of the fact that fat cells and skin cells have different freezing temperatures at which they die. So if you want to lose some fat or sculpt part of your body, you can actually freeze some of that fat away. You can also do this with heat. And there are a lot of different companies these days offering this kind of procedure for, of course, a exorbitant fee. And of course, I'm not about that on this channel. So let's talk about how you can do it on your own, possibly. We're going to test it out. All we're going to need for this experiment is a membrane that you can get on Amazon to protect the skin, some cool packs, and about an hour of time. Getting all comfortable. Gonna put some ice packs on myself. Now here's the situation for me. I've been actually quite skinny. So you're wondering, why would I be doing this for myself? I'm already too skinny. I don't need to lose any body fat. This, this is true. But I'll tell you this. Over the last couple of years, I've been really interested in trying to increase my weight, which I was successful at after the use of some nutrition and uh, a fair amount of weight gainer shakes. I'd been about 140 pounds since I was 16 years old. I'm in my 30s now, and that maintained up until a couple of years ago through the weight gainers. I was able to put on about 25 pounds for the first time in my life, which was awesome. Now I've got some meat on me and it's great, but mm, there is a little bit of pudginess right here that I just don't like. I've never had it before in my life. And so, well, I'd like to see about getting rid of that. Now it's important to note that cryo sculpting or cool freezing is not meant for weight loss. So if you're trying to lose weight, this is not the method for you. However, if you have, uh, if you're already at about the weight that you want to be and you've got some excess fat areas that are, are just kind of funny and you want to trim that down, you want to sculpt it, well, this is, this is that method. And so what I'm going to do, I have several of these cool packs from the freezer and I'm going to trade them out every 15 minutes or so to ensure the, the, the cold stays steady. And I've got this uh, membrane that I'm going to put on my stomach. Ooh, it's slimy. Oh, okay, very slimy. <clears throat> All right, I know, pretty slender looking, but again, it's kind of pudgy. And I feel it, especially when I'm leaning over, I can, I can uh, see some of this, some of this rolling, and uh, I want to get rid of that. So uh, let's yeah, give this a go. This is so gross. It's a little cold by itself already. All right, and just apply the ice pack. And now we wait. Ah, let's get comfortable. <sighs> Gotta get all zen now. Meditate. Breathe in. Breathe out. Is that on squish? <laughs> oh gosh. Oh, I feel that. That's definitely penetrating. That's penetrating. That is not comfortable. Ugh. Is it weird to feel it in your spine? Mm. 
too tense, it's not what we're going for. To look into what some of this uh, this jelly actually is. That is definitely doing something. Definitely doing something. Oh. Hey, that's pretty much it. Simple, right? So why are they charging you so much again? Well, anyway, now you know you can do it yourself. I started off with a waist circumference of about 35 and a quarter inches. It's been barely a week and I've already lost that quarter inch down to 35. So to me, that's proof of concept. Now, of course, remember, this isn't for everyone and it's not a quick way to lose weight. And if you're planning on doing multiple sessions of this, remember to be careful, be safe. And you should probably space it out two to three months to allow the previous treatment to fully take its effect and for those old dead fat cells to have been removed from the body. Now, if you're interested in hearing more about my experience, leave a message in the comments. Maybe I'll do a video in the next few months uh, describing the full results. In the meantime, I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you next time.